but it's exciting time for us as we look to a new era in our volleyball program. On Friday we announced uh, a new head coach in our program. We're excited to introduce him to you today, Tom Peterson. Come on up, Tom. with him a distinguished resume of experience and we're excited to have him as part of our program. We're going to let him uh, talk to you a little bit here, introduce his wife who's with us today. She's very supportive of him and been with him every step of the way. It's been a great opportunity for us uh, to get to know each other and look forward to working with, uh, with he and his staff. So Tom Peterson. Thank you. It is a pleasure to be amongst you, I guess that's how I put it. Uh, first of all, my wife, Cheryl, would you at least raise your hand? Maybe stand up because you're so beautiful. Uh, my much better half. Um, it is a pleasure for me to be here. As I was driving up in the snow just a while ago, I, I realized, uh, and I was talking to my wife, that I started my career at a very young age, I think about four years old. I became a uh, Westmore Elementary Wildcat, and now I've come full circle. So I hope that this is the, my last of my career as a Wildcat. So uh, it is a pleasure to be here. I'm looking forward to. I've met the girls the other day. I've met them, and when we were when I was talking to them, I was very very impressed. I think that when you get a, a group of good people together, great things can happen. And I think that's gonna, what is going to happen. I hope one of my strengths, I believe one of my strengths is uh, how to I train people well, train volleyball players well. And those girls are very eager to go, and we're going to have some good success here, I think, very shortly. And if uh, probably open it up to any questions for just a minute, if anyone has any questions. We read in the paper your kind of resume, but would you expand on that a little bit? Wow. <laughs> well, being rather old now, I, that's kind of a tricky question, but uh, I have coached volleyball uh, five or six or seven or ten, I don't know, places now. Uh, way back when I coached both men and women. I'm from Orem, Utah. And uh, not a lot of male volleyball players grew up in Utah. But I had the, the opportunity to play uh, volleyball when I got into college, having a beginning or volleyball class at uh, BYU at that time. I played there. I coached the club team when it was not a varsity group there with the men. We had some success, so I went to Penn State University. And uh, we had some very good success there. In 1994, we ended up winning the national championship. And that was the first time that anyone outside of California actually had won a national championship. Uh, from there, I came back to, to Utah. I've taught uh, at a university. I hold the rank of an associate professor. And then they asked me to start a volleyball team at Salt Lake Community College, which we did and were successful. Then on to Utah State University as the women's coach, uh, University of New Mexico women's coach, and then uh, back again to BYU with the men. And then Utah State University I uh, was until maybe I still am for a few more days an associate head coach uh, with the women's team there. And uh, so I've kind of been around the block a little bit, and that's kind of my resume. Thank you. You're welcome. Any other guests? Uh, high school girls around Utah, are, are they pretty good at volleyball, or do you have to go maybe to California to recruit? Uh, no, I think that's a very good question. Uh, when I was asked that particular question when I came here. I think we are very blessed for some reason in, our, in the state of Utah to have many, many good women's volleyball players. We produce a lot of good players for the population that we have. And even locally, there are a number of good volleyball players that we would like to keep our eye on and try to get interested in Weber State University instead of going elsewhere. We can win with those girls. Yes, we do have quite a few players that we could recruit from the own area. Nothing else, I'll try to stop sweating here and let someone else take charge if that's okay. Thank you very much. Appreciate your help.